weird but truth. The custom of sacrificing a human being at the erection of a new house or fortress is very old. Foundation stones and beams were laid in human blood the world over, and this disgusting custom was also practiced in Europe until a few centuries ago. However, it is possible to see these and similar traditions all over the world. Foundation sacrifice refers to the practice of burying a human in the foundation of a new building as an attempt to ensure that it stands. Building buildings is an insult to the spirit and gods of this land. In order to appease them, you must sacrifice. In turn, the sacrifices were transformed by death. They became guardians, destined to guard the building that had become their tomb. There are many stories of foundation sacrifices from Haito Bashara in Japan, Da Sang Zong Da Sheng Zhuang in China, Mayasade in Burma, and Tumble Proyek in Indonesia. These words, phrases all express the same brutal reality of sacrificing humans to protect structures from being destroyed by natural disasters, such as tsunamis or attacks from hostile enemies. One of the earliest uses of this tradition dates back to the Roman Empire. It is a punishment given to the Vestal Virgins, a class of priestesses. There are legends and discoveries of bodies entombed in buildings and bridges dating back to the Middle Ages all throughout Europe. Several folk ballads allude to the usage of a human sacrifice to solve issues in a building project or to bestow power on it. The practice of foundation sacrifice has continued to be applied by changing its shape over time. An empty coffin buried beneath the home may serve as a substitute for a body. You may also use a rope to measure a person's height and bury it. Eggs, candles, bottles of wine, coins, and decks of cards have all been employed as sacrificial replacements in the abstract. This weird but truth.